Um, Borough earned a point, a vital point actually, against West Ham at the weekend. And although it was a very disappointing display overall, Gareth Southgate was delighted to get something out of a match that Borough in the past have, have tended to lose. Um, the point, though, doesn't mask a very disappointing display by his players, particularly in the first half, where they're very flat and lacklustre. Uh, in contrast to West Ham, who really rang Borough ragged, particularly in the midfield areas, putting the Borough defence under huge pressure. Um, that's where Borough's best players were on the day, really. Ross Turnbull pulled off some spectacular saves, in particular his last-minute double stop to deny West Ham a winner. Um, and also, throughout the game, he was very solid. Uh, Chris Riggett for me was outstanding in the centre of defence, he had a lot to deal with again because of the midfield's failure to close West Ham down, he made some vital interceptions and he looks as though he deserves a run in that position in the centre of defence. Um, overall though, like I say, a disappointing team performance, um, Gareth did say that he thought his players would be flat, in which case why didn't he change things around, although really Borough should be remaining unchanged after, after going two games unbeaten. Um, West Ham, really on the back of four straight defeats, you'd have thought wouldn't have been up for the fight, but it was really their cup final and the performance, though it was, um, Frank Azola must be absolutely delighted with that performance from his players. But like I say, Borough shouldn't have been caught cold by West Ham, who really needed to get a result after such a poor run. Um, up front, uh, Mado made a big difference when he came on. In fact, the substitutes in general did make a difference when they were introduced. Justin Hoyt came on at half-time, thought he looked um, lively, added some extra width to that um, right-hand side, which had been lacking in the first half. That's not to criticise David Wheater, uh, but he's not a natural right-back, and the sooner he's back in the middle, the better as far as Burr are concerned. Um, as I say, Hoyt did well and had a goal disallowed, although it was a very tight call for offside. Uh, Miro made a big difference when he came on, just simply the fact that he offers a big aerial presence, he gives people an outlet from when hitting balls long, um, he's strong and awkward, he chases lost causes and uh, despite his reputation as being a bit of a selfish player, he certainly justified his inclusion in, uh, in the squad and in the team. Um, Julio Arca, although well short of match fitness, showed a little bit of composure in midfield and it was desperately needed because... As I say, the first half, Diggard and O'Neill didn't really get to grips with the game. So it's pleasing to see Arca just putting in some sensible passes, and he certainly was a big improvement on his display on Wednesday night. And the goal itself, um, people might say fortuitous because it went through the wall, but you've got to take your chances, and Burra did do that. But once again, credit to Ross Turnbull for his fantastic double save, and for the second match running, uh, Gareth Southgate has really him to thank for getting a result out when they may well have lost.